Patriots got here in the first quarter. Brunson gains a step on Black. Brunson knocks it down. Lips have done a terrific job on the board so far. Brunson nails a three. Brunson from three. Bottle better of the corner. Brunson circling up with the left hand and good. Trivia. Hard remains on the floor. Puts up a three from in front of the Magic Bench and knocks it down and then turns. Nick's getting whatever they want. Here's Brunson. Banks it in. Those records will be around for a while because now guys don't play that anymore. Magic by 20. Brunson from three. Hits the floor again. Captain Clutch. Welcome back, man. 26 points, 11 for 19 shooting from the field, 4-7 from downtown. So much for Russ, so much for a bruised knee. Looked great, man. He was another one that was playing kind of angry. You know, Anthony Black kind of insulted him a little bit. You know, try to give him a little flat I, tire. I think there's some fans outside waiting for Anthony Black to go jump him. Yeah, yeah. We try to give him a little flat tire. JB didn't like that. And then, you know, you just got into his bag. <laughs> you just got into his bag and just started lighting him up. So... Welcome back to for uh, Captain Clutch. Got some much needed rest in the fourth, and there you go, man. We look forward to Philly, man. But he looked great tonight. Definitely looked great. He was hitting the deck a little too much for, for my liking. He was hitting the floor a lot, especially in the first. After taking months. charges after coming back from an injury, I'm like, yeah. wow, this guy. He he was back to back to where where he left off, hitting the deck on every play. But hey, ma made it out of there unscathed, relatively. And you live to fight another day. But he looked great tonight, man. 26 points, 11 and 19 from the field. In 29 minutes, CP. Fish 11 and 19 in 29 Fish minutes, 4 7 to downtown. Yeah. Brunson just, as, as soon as the first quarter started, it was, you had a feeling that he was about to go off this game. And it, it's nice to also see that the Knicks dominated and Brunson, as you mentioned, got some rest because. Coming off that knee injury uh, against the Cleveland Cavaliers, you don't want him to extend himself too much. Thankfully, you got much needed help out of, you know, Deuce McBride, Josh Hart, Dante DiVincenzo. Those guys are the guys who really stood up. Dante and Hart playing 42 minutes. McBride spelling uh, Brunson for his minutes as well. Yeah. Those are the guys that you, Tom Thibodeau relied on tonight. And But just going back to Brunson, like, this is, it's like he just came back from vacation and nothing happened. Like, yeah. truly nothing happened, yeah. which is just insane to even think about. Uh, you saw that he was, like, holding his knee at times uh, throughout the game. Was it his hand or his knee? I couldn't tell. It looked like he was just grabbing his knee, man. Like, mm. it looked like he was grabbing his knee. from Like, just from all the contact that he was taking this game. I mean, you mentioned what Anthony Black was doing. He was taking charges. Um, I think it's just not necessarily saying that he re-aggravated it, but the way that he plays, it's such a physical style of basketball that yeah, that's just kind of who he is, man. He, it's gonna his body just takes a toll after just you know taking contact, initiating contact. Yeah, it just starts to add on, man. But yeah. thankfully, he didn't have to play too much tonight. And and hey, right on cue, Morpheus twenty nine sixty nine in the chat. Brunson zero free throws. SMH. So he wasn't impressed. <laughs> he 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 wasn't impressed. I, you know. <laughs> I mean, Zero are you not that's kind of crazy though I mean yeah I guess but I mean come on man on a night like tonight he just got back he had it I going from the outside why, why why do more damage you know I mean he was attacking the inside too yeah. but that, honestly that's a little that, to me it's not the fact that it's not, it's no shade to Brunson to me it's crazy for the refs that they're not even calling him yeah like giving him foul calls because he's he's getting hit tonight man he was yeah he was he definitely was. Uh, Al, here was Tibbs on the return of Captain Clutch, Jalen Brunson. And once again, this is courtesy of SNY Videos. Here was Tibbs on Brunson's return. Jalen goes from questionable you know, game kind of decision to doing what he did right from the start. Just does anything surprise you anymore? No, just, you know, and, and again, same thing with him. Uh, you know, you, you have nothing but respect for him because he does everything he can to get back as quick as he can. Like he's 
you know, two workouts a day. He's on the floor. He's pushing himself in practice. He's there. He goes early. He stays late. Goes through practice. Comes back at night. Gets treatment. Go, works out again. And then, you know, he gets himself ready <coughs> for what he has to face. Uh, he's, he doesn't take hardly any days off, and that's why he can do the things that he can do. You heard Tibbs Al. No days off. That's my kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he loves him so much. He does not take days off. He works and he works and he works and he works. But nah, like in all reality, man, this is this is our point guard. You know what I mean? The work ethic, the leadership. He understands what's at stake. The maturity. Can't take that for granted, man. Everybody can't handle it. Everybody can't do it. I was listening to the roommate show with uh, Ben Stiller on it, and you know, Ben Stiller was asking Brunson about the pressure and so forth. And Brunson really said he doesn't feel the pressure. He yeah. said he's worked, you know, this is, he he and the rest of everybody on the team has that mentality of you put your head down, you grind in, you grind every single day. You put in that work. And that's just something that he's really emphasized, even though over these last two seasons he's been here, that no one really takes it lightly that, when you're part of the Knicks organization that you're not putting in the work. So, you know, when you see your leader, you know, he talks about that, like, and that's one, that's great to hear that the team takes their job so seriously. Right. Yeah. But the fact that your leader is also doing that, that speaks volumes as to, okay, if he's taking it seriously, this is everything that he does on a day-to-day -day basis to be as great as he is. I can't let him down. Right. You can't let the leader down. Yeah. If he's going to be working, even coming back from an injury, because if he's willing to put in that work, to make sure that this team is great and so that they can go to the next level, then what are you doing as, a, as the other individual to make sure that you're being reciprocal to that process, right? And so I think with Jalen Brunson, you just see that level of leadership where he understands how to like connect with his teammates without having to be a lot, without having to be that guy that just says, you must do this, you must do that. He, his actions yeah. speak louder than his words. Big time, big time. And, you know, it's, it's not just him. Like, just, just look at the Nova Trio. Look, look at what they're doing for this team right now. And hey. you can see it by the way that they're playing, CP. I mean, Josh playing. Hart, you know, he even as much as he complains and he jokes about it, right? He'll yeah. complain. He just has to get it off his chest and just say how he hates it. He To take that challenge on whatever Tom Thibodeau asks him to do and to excel at it, you have to work. It's not just like you just show up one day and you do it. You have to put in the work to do it. Look at Dante DiVincenzo this season, the way he's shooting yeah. three ball and just how he's taking his offensive game to another level. That is putting in the work to do so. So Big time. Yes, those guys want to be great, but when you see everybody else around there, putting everyone else around the team putting in that effort, how can you not want to be great? True indeed. It's the culture, man. It's the culture. It's so they're setting the tone. Culture. Tips, tips setting the tone, man. 